Actually, I mean, we were, you know, we, we felt like we were going to be in some kind of racing or something, and uh, motocross was the path we were taking at the time, and uh, with, my, with my dad having a racetrack there, and Mom and Tim getting us uh, drug over into the sprint car portion of it, and, you know, it just one of those deals where it kind of all fell together, and, uh, you know, it just, it is what it is, and I mean, we're here now, and uh, I, I wish I got into it earlier, but yeah, yeah. Uh, we are, we are here, so, I mean, it's been fun, and uh, I wouldn't change a thing. And, and you do it, you know, you do it the hard way. You run your own team here for years. Give me an idea how your operation compares with the, the high-profile outfits like the NASCAR guys have, Tony Stewart, Casey Kane. Budget, number of employees, whatever yardstick you want to use, how does your team compare with those teams? Um, my team probably couldn't run off of a uh, employee for one of the, the, the cup sh shops there that uh, sweeps the floors. I mean, uh, there's just two of us and a uh, third one half of the year. So uh, we don't get paychecks. One guy does. And uh, it's just one of those deals where we go up and down the road and, and love it. Uh, we made it back home last night at the Hobstad and, and uh, got here late last night. We're working all day. So we just uh, we love the sport. And, um, you know, we're going to keep plugging away at it and, and uh, go race Tuesday and then on up to Eldora Friday, Saturday. Go up and down the road with you driving the hauler. Am I right about that? You do your own driving? Yeah, most of the part. Uh, Doug does a lot of driving some, you know, there when I get a little tired or, or beat up uh, uh, from driving some. But uh, it's one of those deals where it is mine and I like it. And, uh, we, you know, I, I do it myself. Cool. We'll take a break on that, though. We'll